I turn around now? No, not yet. Yeah? No. Oh. Now? <laughs> yes. Really? Yes. Wow, <laughs> look at you. You look beautiful, babe. Thank I you. knew you would. Thank you. Beautiful, beautiful bride. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? No. But, but, but I'm on a mic, see? I know. Uh, thanks, baby. Dad. You look great. You do. You happy? That's so very nice. Thank you, my love. You're welcome. I love you. Love you. I love you more than anything. I know. I love you more than anything. Okay. Just wave to our uh, audience fans, yeah. <laughs> Tara, Evan, I love you so very much. God bless you. I hope you're as happy as me and your mother and mother-in-law. Thank you so very much for being my daughter. I love you. How did you two meet? We met in high school. We met when we were 14 years old in almost high school. How'd you fall in love? I knew I loved her when she stepped up and helped me with my daughter. Cause he became, he was the best dad. He was the dad to Callie and he was the best dad ever. He's so sweet, he's so caring. And he loves me. How'd you get engaged? We got engaged on the beach. He asked me to marry him on the beach on our family vacation. I proposed to her on the beach in Erie. What's your favorite thing about her? Her smile. My favorite thing about him is how caring and loving he is towards everybody. What's next for you two? After getting married? Yes, <laughs> oh yeah, after the big day. Uh, maybe some more kids and building a life together after 10 years. Hopefully to have another kid and buy a bigger house. You're never gonna have money to buy a big old house. I know, because I already gotta pay for your stuff. <laughs> <laughs>
I can't believe our day is finally here. Today I get to call you my husband. Something we've only talked about and dreamed about since I said yes to you almost nine years ago. When we started dating, I had no idea the road we would travel together and still to this day it's surreal. But seeing you as a dad, I knew you were different. You quickly became someone I love spending time with and totally fell in love with. I just knew you were my person. You truly are an amazing man and I love everything about you. I love how you love to help everyone in need. I love the way you love our children. And most importantly, I love the way you love me. It's crazy to think that 20 years ago, we were just starting high school and we became friends. If you would have told me back then how our lives would come together and I would be standing in front of you today, I would have never believed you. <laughs> but I can't imagine my life any other way. I used to dream about what my husband would be like and little did I know, God would give me someone so much better than I could ever have imagined. Someone who is so selfless, so caring, hardworking, and completely devoted to his family. My mom would always say, I hope you marry somebody like your dad. <laughs> and today, I'm doing exactly that. We have built a loving relationship and a beautiful family over the last 10 years. And for that, I will forever be grateful. I love the way you always find a way to make me feel special, confident, and beautiful. You truly make me feel loved every day. There isn't enough time to tell you everything I want to or have felt over the last 10 years, but just know you mean the world to me, and I can't imagine my life without you. I am so blessed to become your wife. You are my best friend, my better half, my everything. Evan, I vow to always be faithful to you, to respect you, and to love you no matter what life throws at us. I promise to be your biggest fan and push you to be your best self, like you do to me and our kids. I promise to admire and appreciate who you are as well as the man you will become. I promise to be honest with you, support you, and help you in any time of need, especially when you need me to correct your spelling and grammar. <laughs> I promise to try new things with you and laugh when we do them. I vow to not only be your best friend, but your biggest cheerleader in life. I vow to be the best wife to you and mother to our children and to take care of you and love you through thick and thin. And most importantly, I'll always vow to love Callie like my own and I promise to be there for her and Gannon and to love them both unconditionally. Loving you is the best thing that has ever happened to me you have my heart forever and always. I love you. Tara, today is finally here. After 10 years, I couldn't be happier. Who would have guessed back then we would be standing here today? In the past 10 years, we've been through ups and downs. We've overcame them together to get where we are. We've built a home with love, laughter, and support. I love your family, and I really love the way you love mine. In front of our kids, family, and friends, I vow to love you unconditionally, to stay, to fight, because you are worth the fight, and to face all of life's challenges by your side. Thank you for the support, patience, love, and understanding when I needed you most. I couldn't have done it without you. You stepped into a role that you didn't have to, and I can't explain what that meant to me. I promise to always be there for you, to trust you, care for you, and most of all, I promise to always love you. I will be your partner and your best friend. I will love you as much as you love me. You are truly the most amazing person, mother, and friend. You have made me the best version of myself, and I promise to do the same for you. Each and every day is better because of you. I can't wait to see, I can't wait to continue our lives together. You are my person, my superwoman, and I can't wait to see what our future brings. Superwoman. I like it. Yep. I like it. Very nice. <clears throat> Tara and Evan, please join hands. Under the eyes of God, Tara, 
Do you take Evan to your be lawfully wedded husband? Do you promise to support him and completely love him unconditionally as long as you both shall live? I do. Under the eyes of God, Evan, do you take Tara to be your lawfully wedded wife? Do you promise to com support her completely and love her unconditionally as long as you both shall live? I do. Very well. And then let us proceed. Okay. It's now to time to exchange the rings. So bring the rings up, please. You got on time. Okay. Pardon me? You got on yeah. time. Yeah. In the exchange of the rings, the circle formed by each ring is a symbol of your love and eternal commitment to each other. May these rings remind you always of these sacred promises you have made to each other today in the company of your family and friends. Terry, you will go first. Please repeat after me as you place the ring. Mm -hmm. I, Tara, give you. I, Tara. Evan, this ring is a symbol of my love. Give you this, Evan, give you this ring as a symbol of my love. Commitment and eternal vows. Commitment and eternal vows. That we have made to, today to each other. That we've made today to each With other. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. Okay, Evan, your turn, buddy. Ready? I, Evan, give you. Tara. I, Evan, give you. Tara. This ring is a symbol of my love. This ring is a symbol of my love. Commitment and eternal vows. Commitment and eternal vows. That we have made today to each other. That we have made today to each other. With this ring, I thee wed. With, with this ring, I thee wed. Now, listen up. This is important. <laughs> By the power invested in me, and I do have that power, by the state of Pennsylvania, and God Almighty, okay, I pronounce you Tara and Evan as wife and husband from this day forward until death do you part. God bless you and kiss each other like crazy. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought you were going to say kiss the like, wow. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Mrs. Evan Morta! <laughs> <laughs> Drop those flowers down. There you go. Give her a kiss. Stop it. You're licking my makeup off. <laughs>
and I won't stop now. Woo! Keep your hands up, get them in the sky for the homies that ain't making them. My folks locked down. Woo! I never went nowhere. You know what they say in loot is back. Yeah. Blame it on that conjure. The hood call it loot a yak. Hey! And I'm on this foolish track, so I spit my foolish flow. Blow. My hands go up and down, down. like strippers' booties go. Woo! My verses still be serving, yeah. tight like a million virgins. Yeah. Last time on a college remix, now I'm on the original version. Yeah. Can't never count me out. No. Y'all better count me in. Account, accountants count me in, make millions every year, the South champion, yeah. cause all I do, all I, all I, all I, all, all I, I do, do is win, 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 hey. win, no matter what. Thought I was good, I was good on my own, I was alright. Thought I was grown and the strangers I'd known, they were all right. Thought that I knew everything, never wrong, I was all right. Oh, I was good, I was good on my own, I was all right. Oh, I lived a whole life thinking I knew how my heart could handle love, love I thought I knew. Everything before us was stretching out. Light your days and warm your heart and home. May good and faithful friends be yours wherever you may roam together. Today, we finally and officially have united the Douglases and the Moidas. Yay! Yeah, How long, guys? How long? 49. 49 years. Let's hear it. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. 